Hey there, fellow Detroit Lions fans. I'm back with some sizzling news that's sure to get everyone's wheels turning. But before I spill the beans, let me remind y'all that this NFL season has been a bit different, with defenses shining brighter than usual, which has been messing with the stats. So, stick with me and hit that subscribe button, all right? Now, on to the news. The great news is that our Lions are off to a fantastic start this season, boasting an impressive 6-2 record, putting them in a prime position to lock down the NFC North and potentially make a deep run in the NFC playoffs. However, we've got an intriguing quandary to dig into shortly. After the win against the Raiders, there have been speculations about our general manager, Brad Holmes, needing to beef up the roster for a standout performance in 2023. Let's dive into the details of this unique situation. Looking at teams like the Eagles, Seahawks, and 49ers, who've bolstered their defenses, questions arose about what Detroit needs to do to stay in the hunt. But then, out of left field, Brad Holmes talks about a trade that left everyone taken aback. He stated, Clearly, we lost Marvin and we were short on offense, necessitating us to find someone to fill the void, no matter what. Now, this statement leaves us with a few questions to unpack. The Lions may have put their trust in their defense, which has shown remarkable growth throughout the season. Our QB, Jared Goff, lauded the defense for keeping us in the game last Monday, despite a few turnovers. The defense came through in the clutch, but will it be sufficient? But what's been causing some disappointment is that we've only brought in one player to replace the veteran Marvin Jones. Donovan Peoples-Jones is a solid player, but will he be enough to take us to the promised land? Some folks are frustrated because we didn't make additions as impactful as the Eagles and 49ers did. What's your take on this? So, Lions fans, here's the million-dollar question. Is this move enough to take us deep into the playoffs? What would you have done to improve the team? Share your thoughts in the comments and let's keep the conversation going. Stay tuned for more news and updates about our beloved Detroit Lions. Until next time.